Hello, welcome to Glitch Free Gaming. I am Kieran, also known as Protony in various places on the internet. I'm continuing to play through the Waypoint Forums collections of Mario Maker 2 levels. Is that Rainbow? You get rainbows in this loop. I've not. I don't know how you do that. I need to use this theme more, apparently. Uh, this is Cecil Clouds by James Tarr. We have played a couple of James Tarr levels in previous episodes. They made... Oh god, I'm, they're prolific. They made Skip Squeak Palace, Cautious Caverns, and Heavenly Way. Which were all very, very good. If I remember correctly, Cautious Caverns and Heavenly Way in particular were very memorable. Or apparently not because I don't remember them. But that's more about me than the levels because I'm bad at that. I remember enjoying them. Um, this is going to have seesaws and that makes me sad. Because I'm bad at seesaws. I'm bad at everything in this game. I've not seen this before. I don't think I've used this theme before or played this theme before. This must be the sky theme for world. It's, it's cool looking. It's got rainbows. Oh god. Prana plants there. Eh? Monsters. That's... nope. This one's gonna be one as well. Can't catch me. Oh, no, you did. Never mind. This is a good heart. Oh, ho, ho. that was close. All right, please no more prana plants. That's nice, it's just a twister. That's only slightly more annoying. Or less annoying, actually. Twisters are, they're just so imprecise. Or at least I'm so imprecise with them. I've not figured out how to do them properly. It's definitely possible that you could just 100% nail it. Look at this, I'm just bad at it. Seesaws and twisters, you combined my least favourite things. Okay, that's mean. I do quite like them, but I'm bad. My the two things I'm bad at more so than anything else. How did? Okay. Uh, this one's unnecessary. Nope, it's necessary. Hey, twister, let me get you up here. There we go, buddy. Now I can claim the rainbow. Oh, this level's good. It feels like a Mario level. Like, after, uh, for like some fourth wall breaking here, I literally just finished recording that previous video. So, I literally just finished the hardest level I finished, or one of them. I finished a couple of really hard levels in this series. It's a secret. Oh, it's just a 50 coin. I'm not collecting the 50 coin this time. Okay. <laughs> Whatever. I messed that up. That was a good level. Good job, James. It's not hard. Well, not that hard. It's got some challenging bits. It's got a good theme to it. Good use of rainbows. <laughs> I feel like I'm being like, you know, it sounds like I'm being sarcastic, but I legitimately enjoyed that level quite a lot. Yeah, good job. I look forward to playing James's other levels, no doubt, further into this series, assuming, you know, I make it. All right, next up we have, now hold it, now hit it. I don't, I don't know, it's apparently a reference to uh, Beastie Boys track, or it says Beasties, I, when someone says Beasties, I assume Beastie Boys. But I could just be wrong. Uh, it's a puzzle house, and this is by Joe Doll on here, or Joe D on the Waypoint forums. And our old buddy Eve Secret has a world record, so it's probably really hard because Eve Secret seems better at this game than me. <laughs> oh 
god. Adverts. People advertising things. Nintendo Life. That's not me. Did I hit this? Oh, oh no. Uh, I need to hold it and then I need to hit it. As the name implies. Did it. My hero. I'm not gonna finish this level. I can tell right now that I'm gonna get stuck. I'm bad at this and everything. Oh, that's cool. Pretty easy to. Uh, I'm gonna ignore that. I'm not gonna ignore that. Because that's the way I have to go. I don't need to redo this, which is good. Oh, I didn't realize that was a snake block. I should have. I'm not the smartest, as it turns out. Everyone, please don't play that level as, you know, there. People that are using comments to advertise their levels are not, not people you should support. They're probably bad people. They probably do lots of bad things. I mean, I, I don't actually have any way to, you know, support that. There's no evidence, but the evidence is that they are advertising their level. In comments. I don't want to turn comments off, though. This is the first level that I guess has been, like, shown somewhere else. There's people just watching other people's videos and... I'd like to believe that if we went back to some of those previous levels I played, there'll be comments that are like, Hey, I saw you on Glitch Free Gaming's video. But I don't, I don't want to be condoning this nonsense. Oh, I messed that up. Whoops. I thought it went down. I wasn't paying attention. You guys got lost. You die. You die. Nope. Oh man. Trick shot. I'm just the best. This turns out. Until I die here. Sometimes the camera doesn't want to show me the pipe. Alright, now I got it. Alright. Get the P-switch. Go this way. Get through this. Get up here again. That's a snake one. But if I do this, it's going to be... Okay, let's follow this then. Do I need to... P-Switch probably makes this way harder. I wonder if you're meant to have used it here. Or if that P there means I need to use it. Oh. Oh no! It's definitely what I do. Okay. So you... I'm on the right idea. I want to wait until that end, but I need to drop it rather than throw it though. Oh, give me the... Give me the shell. No trick shots this time. Uh, come on, camera catch up. You go there. Nope. Why does that happen sometimes? Sometimes it goes in no matter where you do it, and then other times it's like, hey, by the way, I really don't want to do it today. Why is this happening? No, really, though. There we go. Just had to give it a wee bit of jump. Right. Take the P-switch. Don't set it off. Which this is here to trick you into doing. Oh, actually jump. Don't just run into spikes like I almost did. Follow the snake block with the awesome Nintendo 64 Mario music. One of the best Mario games. Although, one of the worst controllers. 
Right, here we go. Here we go. Any moment now. I'll nailed it. I'm not doing so good. As it turns out. I'm blaming Hay Fever for this one. It's not what's causing the issues. Is my excuse though. Okay. 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 Okay, go away advert. Yeah, we turn off adverts. But not comments in general, just specifically adverts. Okay. No! Ah, oh, this is such an awkward place to put this pipe. Ah. Uh, it's. It needs to be at least one space to the right. It's just. So awkward. No. No, no, no. Time to give me this shell. Nope. Let's hope it bounce. Instead, I'm gonna die. <sighs> this time. This time, though. This guy is my way out of here. He's my meal ticket. Damn it! That was actually by accident. I was not actually. I would. I could have just taken credit there and be like, "Oh, I wanted to. It'd be faster to just die here than try to get these green ones." But no, I just fell because I'm bad. All right, let's get going. Let's spin up that. Which that seemed fast. I don't think that's how it's meant to work. Oh my god. Do it. Trick shot. Nothing but net, as the Americans say. I guess you don't need to be American to watch basketball, but statistically you probably are. It's not really a... I mean, it's... It's more international than... NFL, I guess. What do you call it? American football? I guess they just call it football. That's not really massively watched outside of America. Baseball somewhat is though. Oh my god. That was cutting it close. I did it. Oh, Jesus. Terrifying me. That's a good level. That was one of the more fun ghost houses I've played. That ship one from the previous video is... Hey! I got a world record! Speed ran it. Look at me, I'm a speedrunner. I'm just... I can't not go fast now. After... <laughs> that last video. Yeah, uh, If you didn't watch the end of that last video, you should watch the level I played, because it's nuts. And it has trained me to be good at this kind of stuff. This level's great. Good job, Jodo. I look forward to seeing what else you make. Next up, we have a pair of levels by Airship C on here. Airship right on the form. First one is Ice Launch. The second one will be called... Don't forget Sunblock. Um, describe these as a mix of puzzles and classic platforming. So let's see how this goes. I'm sure they'll be good. Clear it's not too low. I don't know why I say that every time. It doesn't actually matter. I'm going to play them no matter what. It's not like I'm going to be like, oh, it's got 0 0.001% completion rate. I'll never play this one. I'm going to play them no matter what. Because that's what I'm here for. I'm doing a uh, service, I guess. I don't know. You're useless to me. I assume one of these is going to have something useful in it. That's the dry bones one again. Why did I do that? That's not how pipes work. Oh, no, no. Die. Ah, it's been too vindictive against the dry bones. So I want the first one. I want to see what's in the third one. It's probably also dry bones. So does this one have dry bones in it? Oh, God, worse. Worse. 
There's moles in it. Another fun one, like we, you know, got back to his family in one of the previous videos. Why did I do that? I knew it was in it. I knew how this went. I've seen this story before. Okay, okay, okay. This one. So this one's also dry blood, right? Oh no, it's another turtle. Oh, God. That didn't really work out. Oh, it was the green, the red one I needed because I needed to be here, so this. That's smart. Uh, oh, it's a Bob One puzzle. My favorite puzzle. Apart from the bit where... Oh, weird. That's... I don't think that's how it's meant to work, but that's cool. So you can make bob stack against each other and it pushes them through barriers, like coins. I wonder if it goes through... Oh, Jesus. That was unfortunate. Something about the bells that started this always remind me of Futurama. Oh, the coins don't block them, it's just they can't get off the conveyor belt. Okay, that makes more sense. Just go. Oh, this is gonna be bad. This is gonna be very bad. For everyone involved. But mainly me. Because I'm the only one involved. Oh no, it's bad for these ball arms as well. It's a snowman. Or it's a snow pokey? It's not actually. Oh no, 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 no. This kind of thing I put my levels. Um. Hey, that's cool. Oh, Jesus. That's uncalled for. Yeah, those first bells always remind me of the, the Futurama intro. <laughs> but it's also very Christmassy. I expect to see a lot of levels in this theme at the end of the year. I'll probably make a Christmas themed level this year. I've never done that before, because I've never had the snowy ones before. Oh jeez, that's terrifying. Okay, run, 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 run. Run, die. Damn it. So I need to bob on these. So that I can get the Monty Moles to go and hit on the music blocks and release the spring and probably something else. Something super handy, like, I don't know. I, it's, a, it's Donkey Kong. Probably Donkey Kong. I should add Donkey Kong to this game. I hope they add more themes to this game, or more games to this game, like they they split games and themes up like that. Um, because they added 3D World, but they called the space for it Worlds or Games, I forget. Like it's something that implies there would be more than one in that menu. But right now it's the only one in there. So I wonder if that means they're going to add more in DLC. Because Mario Maker 1 got a lot of DLC. They had lots of great things like um, costumes of, uh, you know, famous things like a car and Baby Metal. The Baby Metal one was pretty good actually. Didn't use it much. I didn't really use any of the costumes much, but hey, that's how it goes. Come on. Apologies. Oh god, I broke it. There was enough moles in there, I could have really just moved to the right. Instead of just standing there eating bombs. Ugh, apologies for the grossness. I'll leave my last video for the night. Because I'm slowly falling to my 
well, I think it's hay fever. Okay, give me the bubble bombs. I only really need the one. Because that releases enough of them. Come to me. Oh. Oh. Oh, neat. I didn't even notice this bit was down here before. Goodbye, you stupid moles. You only kill me once, though, to be fair. I only need two of them. It was all a waste of time. You make it with two. But then how are you going to get to the top of this? I'm the best. This is a good level. I know I say that with every level, but I mean it at every level. All right, now we're gonna cut to the next one uh, by the same person whose name I definitely remember because it's on screen, which is Airship C. Uh, next level is called Don't Forget Sunblock. Like I said, don't forget sunblock. Oh, it looks bright. In the desert, I bet there's gonna be an angry sun. Oh, there's an angry sun in the middle, you can see it. The angry sun. I didn't play a massive amount of Mario Bros. 3 as a kid. Or I was really bad at it and didn't you know, finish it. Or really even get far enough. You don't have to get that far to see the sun. Uh, at least if I did, I don't remember. Oh god, the thing I remember more is the the scary mask from 2. Which again, is not a game in this. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god, oh god. I'm panicking. Ah, uh, no. I almost jumped right into it. It's a good thing the sun kind of sucks, eh? throw at me. Who you throw at me? Nothing. That's right. Okay, now you throw something at me. Taking your little angry goddamn bullet. Little arms. Are those meant to be arms? I think I said this in the previous video. They look like little arms. But then the big ones don't have them. I want the big ones to have little arms. Like, not scaled up to the size of the big ones, like the bonsai bills. I want them to have little arms. Like a T-Rex. Oh my god. Oh my god. And also feathers. Everyone knows bonsai bills historically had feathers. This is just Nintendo pushing incorrect, you know, based on science. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Jumping on this beach ring. What do you even call those beach rings? Oh no. No. I'm gonna die. I don't wanna. Oh no. This went poorly. If I was smart, I could have hit that button and got them trapped there. But I'm not smart, and so I died instead. Which is not really a good alternative. Alright, I know I'm doing that. I'm dying to that again because I'm an idiot. But at least I know I'm an idiot and that's the important thing. I do love the Mario Bros. 3 music. Honestly, I think I've developed like a really good uh, like appreciation for Mario Bros. 3 that I didn't necessarily have as a kid. Mainly because I think I played World first. And World's a better game. But 3 is also very, very good. Oh, man. But it's just that thing where I only played like the intro stages of 3 as a kid because I was bad at it. My main, like, 
way of consuming Mario games when I was super young was to watch my mum play them. And my mum preferred World, so I saw all of World. Like, she completed that whole thing and I watched. Oh, I'm an idiot. This crouch animation's new. They yeah, added it for this game. Oof, that was so close. That was terrifying. Yeah, so they added crouch animations to 3 and the original Super Mario Bros. Presumably because they added slopes to... Well, did they already had slopes? I'm questioning myself. Oh, stupid son. I appreciate them using the like, ghost house as the intro. Especially because it means we're going to have to come back here at some point. Why do I keep running into that plant? Why do I do things when I know they hurt? Why did I eat all that takoyaki? Oh god. The crouching gave me no tactical advantage there. Uh, I just wanted to let them know that was not a threat. And then I killed them. Alright. The sun's gonna get me. The sun can't do it unless you're on the ground. But I am on the ground. Or maybe slightly off the ground. But only slightly. It's mostly useless. It's just scary. These fire spinny things are way more dangerous. Duh. Oh god, hay fever. No! What has happened here? That's not... That's not what you're meant to do! This isn't good. How am I meant to do this? Okay, I did it. It seemed scarier than it was. Oh god, I almost got stuck on the Uh, you put the mushroom in the middle every time. Which is fine. Oh god. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh no. Come on, son. Nope. Yep. Yeah, I didn't think I was going to do that. This is tough. How did I do that? How did you do that? I mean, I almost did it. But how did I do it? Don't run into the plant. Ugh. Every time. I never move my mushroom past there. These could have fire flowers in them for all I know. I'll never know. Damn. It's a toughie. Harder than the first one. Almost ran into it again. Can I do this without dying? Nope. I'm always going to eat that hat. I've done it every single time. I don't necessarily eat a hat here though. There must be a faster way of doing this. What happened there? The jump went all weird. Come on. Oh, come on. Let me up there. Get me away from the sun. Being Scottish and pasty and white, I can relate to all of this. The sun is the enemy. 
is dangerous. And I don't like it. It's unnatural. We don't really get it much here. It doesn't show up. Oh my god, this is... This is bad. I mean, not the level. level's good, but this... But me doing this is bad. Right. At least they didn't overlap again this time. I don't know how that happened. But it was scary. Alright, son, you can't get me. Everyone knows the sun can't get you if you're not on the ground. This is science. Astron- Oh, god damn it. Jump. Oh no. This is actually harder than when they were in sync. I need to remove this one. This is gonna be- I'm gonna die doing this, I can just tell. This is gonna come down, I'm too late. Next time we go round. I'm just adding more! But maybe that's okay. Nope, it's not okay, because I died. I didn't even get back to the tough puzzle. This time though. I'm definitely not gonna make it, I can tell already. That was stupid, even for me. That's the worst one yet. Oh, come on, come on. Right, let's do this. Let's just stand on this for, oh no. I need to actually commit to that and not do it afterwards. If I stand on that, he won't come out and shoot fireballs until too late. That's my new play. That's this one good to. We can do this. My adapter for my controller has had a red light on it since like part way through the last video. And I'm terrified it's gonna run out of battery any second. It's just mushrooms. It's just mushrooms. It was all for naught. I wonder if they intended you to get hit there then. Because I certainly found it very difficult to not. Let's get through this level. I love these little flame jets. You can set them to alternate in times, so just how you make things like this. Uh, whereas I usually just do it to set off bob bombs at different times and different places. Or I made a boss fight in a level recently against a giant magic Koopa where the floor was fire and there's two alternating things that were on one of these tracks just you know going back and forth shooting flames one at a time it was very silly people said it was the hardest part of that level even though I kept doing it first try every time which I think I mentioned in the previous uh, video but that's just how it goes I find at least when I'm making levels you get really good at things that other people will struggle at and vice versa so I kept dying on like what was essentially the first jump of my last level and there are zero deaths on it like there are no crosses on it no one died there and then it's uploaded oh god son please don't kill me please don't kill me please don't kill me please don't go away I finally managed to do this properly you can't kill me now this is cruel Right. Where does this go? Nowhere. Does it spit something out? No. Okay, you need to just no. This isn't gonna work. It's not optional. Oh, you go over the top. This is made work. Can I cheat? Ah, <laughs> oh, come on! Just go! Do not let my sacrifice be in vain! Oh, thank god. You get my way. I wonder if there's something in those other ones, but I don't care. Not enough for this, at least. It's probably just. Oh, 
mushrooms. <sighs> All right. What we got? The end of the level. We did it. That was hard. I enjoyed it though. I'm really bad at it. The game this spring is too hard. You're not wrong, unpro. But as the real pro to me. Pro to me. There used to be someone. I can't remember which game it was. I think it was like Halo. I match made against like the same guy multiple times and he kept calling me pro to me. Which is fair. It's not very clear what my name is. Anyway, that was a really cool level. Don't forget Sunblock. It's tough. Um, Airship C has another level called Meritocracy, which is a multiplayer versus level. There's no way to guarantee we could play multiplayer. Unless I download it and play a local multiplayer with someone, which I'm not gonna do. Um, but I'll give it a run through if it's posted in the thread. If it's not, I don't know. But for now, here's another one from the thread. Next up, we have the Hammer Slammer by Magic Eshel. You may remember Magic Eshel from previous episodes where they made Cooper the Slow and Thwomp Romp. Thwomp Romp took up a lot of... Is your first episode of the second episode? Because it's so hard. Uh, their other levels haven't been as hard, but they've been very fun still. They're very well made. Um, this one is going to have spoilers in it, which is weird. Um, basically, there's a item you unlock from the end of Mario Maker 2's story mode. And so if you really don't want to know what that is, then, you, then I'm probably too late because it's, you know, whatever. Um, yeah. We're going to play this level. It's, this uses it. So if you've left, you're not going to hear this. But yeah, at the end of the story mode, which I've not actually finished yet, but I've played other levels that unlock this. Um, you get this hammer that lets you destroy blocks, and then also you can make blocks, and then you can smash them. I think you can also destroy thwomps with it, which is pretty cool. Uh, but you can only use it in 3D world. I want this is okay. Uh, oh, okay, let's make five of them. So Magic Kestrel has made a tutorial of sorts. Okay, you can make five of them. I don't think I'd do that though. Oh, that's fine. Nope, that's not fine. I'm an idiot. It's still tough. Even if you have a power up, they can literally make floor. I like how the pipes look in 3D world. I'm gonna look. I know this isn't interesting to anyone. But if you look at it, it's not too bad here actually. The lava kind of overflows with it. But they don't look like they fit in the world very well a lot of time, which is unfortunate. I almost threw another one, which would have got rid of the one I was standing on. Hey, buddy. Me, your friend. Okay. Die, 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 die. Oh god, I need to. No, you can jump and use it. Okay. I thought I had to make. How terrible would it be to make things in Mario Maker? I should do a video one day where I'm making levels. But I'm not very good at making levels, this thing. Alright, this is a cool level so far though. It's a good use of this power up. Good little tutorial to teach you how it works. Which I kind of wish I'd had when I first, you know, encountered a level with it. Because I had no idea how it worked and I couldn't finish the level. Oh no, oh no. This does not bode well for us. Here we go. Can I kill him if we go here? Oh my god! You're a, a persistent little thing, aren't you? I, I don't know. 
Is he getting a hammer power up now? Ah, that was stupid. I'm going right next time. This is just one thing. It's easy. 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 Hoisted by my own petard. Right. Give it to me. Right. This time, I murdered him. I do. That block doesn't do it. That's so why I could like wall them in. Please persist in that nothing else. Die. Die. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Eat hammer. I don't know how powerful the hammer is, but it seems pretty good. I remember so little about 3D World. Oh, they both just leave the same place. That makes sense. Cool. Not the most complex level in the world, but a good tutorial on to, like, how to use this hammer. Which is, you know, not a thing that the game does, I don't think. Again, I've not actually unlocked it, so maybe it does. But, yeah. I just like it gives it the Mario Baker costume. It's about time. Oh, someone's got law comments. Amazing. All right, and the next magic extra one we're just gonna go straight into. No cuts. I know it's crazy. It's unheard of, except for that one time I did it before. Is Operation N three one three final assault. Which you may remember, Operation M313 from the hit video game series Metal Gear. It's the recreation of the final building from Metal Gear. Which I don't understand how you do that because that game's top down, but let's see how this goes. Oh my god. I don't really remember a lot about. Oh my god. Oh, this is the trucks and this. I was gonna say I don't remember a lot about the end of Metal Gear, but actually, there were trucks in the desert. I do remember that. Oh, I messed this up. I don't remember. I guess you had the bomb walls at some point. Yes, yes, I get it. I'm just being really slow because of this. I don't believe that. That seems unlikely. Is that just because I botched this? Yeah. I don't need to die for that though. I assume there's a bit of Metal Gear refill in that of lava. That seems like a Metal Gear thing. I love that series, but that first game is maybe a bit of a. I did it again! A bit of a blind spot. I did finish it. Back when 3 came out. And had. And again. I'm gonna bomb it first. Wait, can I just get through here? Oh, I'm stupid. I'm overthinking it. Where's this go? Oh, we have a boss fight. Finally. Okay, move it. I don't know what this is. All these sound effects. I mean, regardless of its connection to Metal Gear, this level's pretty good. 
I should watch like a video of the end of Metal Gear or something to see how close this is. Obviously, you know, Extreme Liberty is giving us a Mario level. And again, not top down, because you can't do that. Maybe Mario Maker 3 for that one. No! Oh, it was. There were strong gusts of wind in Metal Gear. You had to wear a bomb suit. And Big Boss doesn't tell you that until after you've already been blown around because. Because he's a good person that's definitely not going to betray you at any point. That'd be silly. Oh. I'm so glad they put Snake back into Smash Brothers. He was one of those characters that I didn't like playing as, but I really loved, you know, the series he's from, so it's nice to see him in it. And then actually in Ultimate I got way into playing as him. I got not good as him, but better than I was. I one of my most successful videos on the internet is a clip of me like juggling a, a Greninja online as Snake. He keeps Greninja has like this downward spike where he just comes straight down and I bounced off I bounced him with like this guided missile that Snake can use. I don't know why I'm describing this, I can just insert it in. Here is here, if I remember. I won't remember. Oh my god. This level... It's good, but I'm bad at it, as with every level. Oh my god, stop shooting my bombs! That's cool, I don't know you that well. Alright, let's go. Small Mario. Infiltrating Outer Haven. I think it was the second game. No, it was the first game. The second game is um, Zanzibar Land. Nope, I'm dead. Oh! It's pro skill snake. I don't think I can finish this bit of the twister. I think I'm too bad. I don't think I'm. I think I'm too bad at this game. I think it requires some skill. The clear rate on this level wasn't even that bad. I just need to make sure I'm big at that point and eat the hit. Just run it. I think that's all I need to do. Oh no, I don't have the mushroom. Can't eat the hit. Oh wait, there's a fire flare through here. I forgot about this. That's what you're meant to do here. Oh my god, I'm too stupid. You're meant to use the fire flower to ignite the bomb, not duck in like some weirdo. Is it good use of, um, what do you call it, the slanted edges? It looks very cool. Oh my god. Get up there. Okay, I can't kill Spanies. Take me to freedom. Look at that, I even still got a fire flower. I didn't need to still have it. I don't know what that effect was. There's a lot of fire flowers this level.
I don't remember this boss fight from Metal Gear. But again, I don't remember a lot of Metal Gear. Maybe this is exactly the same. Oh, I missed that shoe. Got this one though. Oh god. I know what I need to do. Oh, these bombs are scaring me. How do I do that one? How do I even blow this up? There must be a way. Oh, I know the way. Down the Metal Gear. Oh, I have to kill Big Boss in this minefield. I need to get up there. I can't not get up there. It is literally the only way I win this. Ah! Oh, is there? I mean, Big Boss. Who would have guessed you were a traitor this whole time? To your country. To the boss. Oh god, I messed this up right for the start. No, stop it. Stop messing this up. Come on, Kieran, you're better than this. That was bad. That was silly. Should have known better. Now I can just sit back and relax. Let the Bob Omb can and do all the work for me. I mean, Metal Gear. Oh no, I can't. I may have actually made this worse for myself. Because it's actually way harder. Ugh. This is... This is a bad place to be. Ha <laughs> ha! I think it was the first one died in there. Alright. No, 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 no. Not doing that again. I don't think I need this shoe. I definitely don't need this shoe. Okay, at this point I just need to take out this guy. Oh my god! Stop it! It's such a pain. Okay, I need to try not to lose this fire floor. And instantly lose the fire floor. If you got that on your bingo card, congrats. Ah, oh God, I've, I've, I've forked it. I've ruined everything. Ah, oh, come on. Damn it. Oh, man. As they said on... Like, what was the name of the show? Garth Marenghi, Stark Place. I believe Mon means man. But I don't think Och means anything at all. What a good show. <laughs> no. This is monstrous. It's not even that hard. I'm just bad at it as always. I really need to catch up here now that I've messed this up. Oh my god, right. 
Die. Okay, this is... Okay, I guess? Of all the places it could have, you know, started fire them into. It's not the worst. It's kind of a pain. Oh, this is gonna make it worse. I need to blow these up. Let's just try to do that. Oh, that was too close. Alright, let's do this and then die. Yep, that's exactly what I wanted to do. I definitely didn't want to be big going into this boss fight. That would be crazy. Alright. The trick was to stop being scared of bombs. Which is not really good life advice. But you know, if you learn your life advice from Mario, you maybe have other issues. Oh god, I'm just gonna shoot him. It's gonna take forever. It would take less time for him. Do this. Come on. Oh god. I don't know how many hits it needs with a fire flare to kill. It's pulled quite a lot. This is just like that minefield boss fight. Only less annoying. Remember if that boss was hard or not. Uh, uh, I remember saw three theme song go start playing. Base does explode at the end of every Metal Gear game. Okay, I have no idea how similar to that that you know to Metal Gear that is, but it was a fun level in its own right. That was a good level. Good job, Magic Astral. Your levels have been kind of across the board really good so far. Keep it up. So next up, we have the new level from Eve Secret, or Donut Secret. Uh, I say new, yeah, new level. I think they've actually uploaded a couple since. But I'm way behind on this thread. Oh, ignore those. Clear is 49%. They described this as alternate universe 1-1. One, one. They said it's really easy. It's kind of 1-1, one, one, but with some twists to it. So, I'm up for that. I always like kind of twists. Oh god. <laughs> okay, apparently there's a secret room. I think the implication is meant to be that this is an alternate world where Mario was the bad guy. Those little Goombas wearing hats. What's that? There are cannons up there. Interesting. Interesting. The deep lore. Did I miss anything? Oh, I find this secret room. I miss this guy. Give me your clothes. Okay, there's nothing up there. Hmm. Where would the secret room be? Oh god, that all went burly. It's not this last one, right? It must be more elaborate than that. This is the one I came through, it's gonna knock me back. But I need to find the secret room. Because the level itself is not that long, because it's just 1-1. One, one. But I need to know what the secret is. 
what's the secret behind this? Hmm. No, I couldn't do that. That didn't work. Why is there a... No, whatever. Take my hat from me. The fools. I've gotten stronger. Oh, no! You give me your cloud. Oh, Jesus. Why can you do that? How is that a thing this game allows? <laughs> okay. Let me skip this one. Is there any mushroom? I don't think there is any. Get a spiky helmet. Let's go kill this cloud man, because it must be the cloud, right? Can you go into the pipe with the cloud? Oh god, not at this speed. It's so far back. No, it doesn't come with you. There's definitely a thing up there. That's how you're meant to get it though. Hmm. So it must be another pipe then, right? There's a blue pipe that leads to the end back there. So there must be a blue pipe down below. Maybe the opposite, do I may not want to have any of these? So that I don't smash all these goddamn blocks. I tried all these pipes. Oh god, I went to this one again. Where would the secret area be? It's probably somewhere real simple and I'm just silly. Give me your cloud. Ah. Watched it. Oh no, I got it. Right in time to lose it. So that's where you come back up from the, the one before. This one you can't go down. Oh no, this is the one you come back up from. Is it even possible to get that 50? Hmm. I think I need to finish the level now. I don't think I can. I oh, don't know I can. Oh, but I can't do this. No, I'm doomed. One more try. Try to find the secret area. And then if I can't do it, I'll just finish the level and you can go find it yourselves. Let's try not taking any of the helmets. Mm, I almost took that one. This is probably not the right way to do this. But I can at least find out where the right entrance is. Oh my god. Oh no. Maybe I don't want to. Yeah, I definitely feel like there's maybe another entrance to that. I'm going to find it by going the wrong way. Because I'm crazy and bad at this game. And it's gonna be somewhere really obvious that we've missed. Oh god. Give me the give me the spiky hat. You get back here with my cloud. So I can cheat and get to the end of the level. It must be hidden somewhere so obvious. 
in plain sight. I mean, it could just be this. Maybe there's no secret. Come on, mushrooms. Oh, I lost it. That's no good. That's no good at all. Hey, at least go to that. Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god, this is terrifying. Wait, there's a door. Oh, that was the entrance. Okay. I was so confused. Unless the entrance is that you're meant to be able to somehow jump up here to break this floor and get through. Which is also possible. Or does one of those pipes go... Do you need to be the hat and come through a pipe and smash that? I bet that's what it is. And there's no way for me to reverse that. I can't reverse engineer that to see which pipe it is. Oh well, there's a hidden area. I cheated to get to it, but you could probably do it properly. This is a really good level. I liked it a lot. Good job. One more for the road. This is zero GC so by Lydum or if if I already forgot what their name is on the forums. Let me find it. It's only fair. Efton or Efton. Have I been saying that wrong the whole time? Anyway, I know I've been saying it wrong the whole time. Precise seesaw jumps with half walls and low gravity. That sounds like things I'm bad at. It seems like a level that was made solely to anger me and make me die a lot. Oh, zero G. I was like, how do you get up there? Zero G. It's also the worst Mario. Oh my god. Go down. No! Survive! Mario! You can do it, buddy! You're making ground very little. No, you're just... No, that's not it. Ain't it. I should just go back down and jump, as it turns out. It's not really worth it. Just go push me up there. Yep. Oh no. Oh no. Why? Why would I want to do that? Okay. Give me this coin. No, no, no. Oh, thank god. Nope, too high. Zero G's really a pain in the butt. I messed up, I messed up. Oh no, you can just keep spinning pretty much forever. Oh god, do I need to... Tell me I don't need to do this. I don't wanna. I can't get in that door. Is there something here? More seesaws. There's also a button somewhere. This cannot be what I need to do. That doesn't make sense. Oh, there's a... There's a button somewhere that I'm missing. Hmm. I'm not 
sure about how to do this one. I'm not that great at solving puzzle levels. Despite evidence to the contrary, with me breaking a couple of them in the past. Come on, come on. Uh, nope. There has to be a better way to end that. It can't be that. But I think I can do it that way. And that's the important thing. Whether you're meant to do it that way or not is irrelevant. Whether you can do it that way or not is the important question. Oh, I've botched this. No, I haven't. See? There we go. Now, how do I get out of here? Oh, Jesus. I think I need to hit the switch before I do it so I can get to that door down there. Let me find where the switch is. I assumed that the keys would take me to the switch, but probably not. Oh god, oh god, oh god. That's terrifying every time. Because I assume the keys actually just take me to that. Like they, they... Mm, I don't know. Let's just jump out of here, see what there is. Bunch of stuff I can't get on. A switch. End of the level. Yep. Oh, hello. Hey, we have a coin. Can't, I can't wall jump from this, right? This isn't gaining anything. It is, and that's silly. This cannot be the intended way of doing this. Oh, I messed up. Doing these super long wall jumps cannot be the intended way of doing this because it's very silly if it is. There has to be something I'm missing. Like, can you wall jump up to get that? Because now I'm kind of stuck here because I messed this up. I don't think I'm doing this right. Doing this. That's so close. Haha. <laughs> I did it. I'm the best Mario player in the world. Can I do this? I don't think this is intended either. I didn't even get another coin. Did it. I'm the best at Mario. I feel like I cheated. I don't think that's what you're meant to do. I'll try and do it properly. But I hope I got... Oh, I didn't even get the record. Alright. One more run at it. See if it... Well, I say one more. It'll probably be a couple. But one more attempt to try and get all the coins and do it properly and not cheat. I don't want this series to just be me cheating my way through every level. But... It might become that. And that's also okay. I don't think you're meant to do this. But I don't know what you're meant to do if you're not. This just seems very silly. Though. At a level that's otherwise very well designed. These long jumps. But I guess the whole point is supposed to be zero G. Oh, I messed it up. I wonder if there's a way to jump properly to get that without me doing this stupid... No, I'm not even doing it right anymore. I can't even cheat properly anymore. I 
I did almost reach that door, though. Yeah, I don't know how to do this properly. I'm not very good at this. Puzzle solving nonsense. Although, really, I solved the, the greatest puzzle of all, which is how to finish the level. I just didn't do the actual puzzles. I think you're meant to fall into that one. I just know how you're meant to get back out is the main thing. Just jump to the other sea, so I know it's to the right there. Ugh, it's so hard though. If this was Mario 3D World and I had the long jump, it'd be easier. Okay, I give up. I can't do this level properly as it turns out. But assume you're meant to get the three coins and make the blues solid, and then you use those slit seesaws at the top to get up to the end, the way that I go there. Uh, and you're not meant to just jump through gaps that you're not meant to be at. Oh, oops. I think that saw is solely there to stop you from uh, getting up enough run speed to just jump across the level. Because with, you know, zero G, you could get pretty far. Oh. Hey, is that what you're ready to do? You're ready to wall jump back. I'm not as stupid as I thought I was. And if I just jump to the right, which I don't know if it's the intended way again. If I just jump to the right, I know there's a seesaw here. So I have a key now. It's probably to do. Oh no. Now hit the button. Which I assume, if you're better jumping than me, you should be able to wall jump and do that and not have to do this. But you can basically spin forever. And then come down here, use the key. I feel like I'm definitely skipping something still, like these jumps seem unintended. But at least closer to probably what was actually intended. Okay, let's see, so I'll come up here, jump across here. I could really just jump from the one below. And then I did it. I'm best. That's probably closer to the actual intended route. I like the idea of level, but I just got lost. They could probably use some like coins or something to guide you. Um, or just smarter players. If you could, if you could get better players than me, then it's probably a better level, right? This is entirely user because I'm bad. I like it though. Uh, Lydon or Etvin has been coming up with some of the cooler level designs we've been playing. They haven't all worked like 100%. Like, out of sync, I thought it was kind of just really hard at Ghost Factory. You kept falling through the floors and it was weird. And I broke it again by going the wrong way. But they've been interesting ideas and I think that's important. And they're fun. No world record times, though. That's going to do it for this episode. We're just going to briefly show if I have any world record times. I should have the one I got either earlier this episode or end of last episode. I've got this one. Free big thwomp. Locks with a view because I broke it. I broke it wide open. Um, I wish it showed a leaderboard to see how much faster I was than the next one because... Yeah, I broke that one. Anyway, next time we'll probably play some of these levels. 
because these are a lot of the people I keep meaning to follow everyone and then I keep forgetting because I'm bad anyway go follow these people play these levels the codes are below if you have a level you want me to play put it in the comments like subscribe all that bullshit bye